Welcome back to Zoomers RV of Wabash, Indiana, as we continue our 2021 Zoomers Virtual RV Show. Today we are looking at fifth wheels and we are going to start big. This is a C-Class fifth wheel. It's the 2021 Sierra 3440BH. It's a little bit under 40 feet long. It has a bath and a half, dual entry. It does have a bunkhouse. This has a welded aluminum frame, vacuum bonded laminated superstructure. So it's very well built, no give here. It will last you a good long time. We have this beautiful awning above my head with LED light strip underneath. You'll notice that we have pass-through storage right here. There are actually two lights, one for each side, which you don't always see, but I definitely appreciate. We have these good size baggage doors here. We also have TV hookup if you want to do a tailgate TV. The store is hiding it a little bit, but we have outdoor speakers with blue LED lights. We have these moored steps, quad steps that easily go in to the camper when you want to pack up and go. We have a nice little grab bar to help yourself in and out. So this entry will take you into the living area. And then this entry here will take you into the half bath, which in turn will take you into the special T-type bunkhouse I was speaking about. This has equipped with a Wi-Fi router and a range extender. So it doesn't come with Wi-Fi, but it does come with Wi-Fi prep. This one does have the seasonal protection package and dual entry. So both entries have the Morad quad steps. A lot of times you'll see fifth wheels where one entry has a quad step that has a Morad, and another entry will have it kind of fold up and aren't quite as easy or sturdy to use. We have this large outdoor refrigerator, Everchill brand, fridges over here. As you see, there's a good amount of storage here, so even if you have a lot of people camping with you, you can all utilize this. We have a swing out grill here, which I obviously don't have space to show you, but it swings out. It's this nice grill area. Rooftop access with this ladder here, and of course, a spare tire. Let's go ahead and see what the inside of the Sierra has to offer. Here we are inside this Class C fifth wheel. Now, as promised, there's going to be a lot to look at. We're going to start here in the booth. This booth, of course, folds down to create a sleeping area. We have nice LED accent lighting underneath. Super attractive. Big windows all throughout the slide. Nice overhead cabinetry here. And this couch folds out to make a hide the bed. So when you're using your hide the bed or your couch, you're looking at this really nice big flat screen TV, this 32 inch fireplace. You have more blue accent lighting underneath your fireplace. And this TV is literally surrounded by storage. So I have storage here. I have storage here. I have storage here. And I think you get the idea. Let's look up for a second. We have our AC, some nice, beautiful, modern lighting. We have a ceiling fan. In the very center of this kitchen, we have our kitchen island with a single cutting board that comes off. You got a single deep basin sink. Put it back. This gives you a nice flat surface to work with. There is storage over here. So you have some storage and even more. Here in our kitchen area, we have this nice long LG microwave, cabinetry all around, this nice backsplash here. We have um, an outlet. You need to plug in any of your kitchen gadgets. This folds down to create even more counter space than just the kitchen island. Folds up to give us a three burner cooktop, accent lighting, gray stone oven. And this is a good sized oven. I'm a lot bigger than a lot of the ovens you'll see in other campers. Here we have this nice big Everchill refrigerator. So this comes with it so that when you are transporting your RV, this kind of keeps it shut. Bear with me just a second. I will show you the inside of this very large refrigerator. There we go. Very secure. So we have the side-by-side -side type top up here. We have drawers and shelves. And you can adjust it to meet your family needs. 
And then we have this big pull-out freezer on the bottom. So you have this deep here. See so if you want to store something. If you want any more. This is plenty big for you and your whole family and your guests. We have storage over here. Nice little control panel. And more storage. We have an outlet here. So this is a good place for a coffee pot. That is something you would like. And storage here. So in addition to the storage all the way around the TV and all this cabinetry, we even have a pantry. The pantry is self-lit. You have these nice shelves here. So plenty of room to store everything you need. Now earlier I was talking about the bunkhouse. Let's start at the bunkhouse and then work our way forward. So as I promised, this bunkhouse is a little bit different than what you're used to. So you have a queen down here, you have some storage, hanging wardrobe up top, some drawers down here, outlet and table window. And then up here, we have another queen with a window and some storage. And if you see this ladder here, a lot of times with ladders that I see on campers, I am not comfortable getting up on this ladder because they're small. But this is built right in, very sturdy, very thick. I don't feel uncomfortable going up and down. So I know you can't see it, but there is an outlet here. Now two smaller windows with curtains up here. So both people's or sets of people's will be quite comfortable. This bunkhouse sleeps up to four people. Like I said, we have a half bath. You should probably put the ladder up before you use it though. There we go. We have this nice foot flush toilet. We have our sink, some storage underneath our sink, and this really big medicine cabinet. As you can tell, this is just really big for a medicine cabinet and of course an outlet. Now let's go ahead. We're going to go look at the full bath as well as the master bedroom. So here we are in the full bath. We have this nice mirror. We have a sink, outlets over here. And of course, storage underneath our sink. We have a stand-up shower with skylight, Dometic um, foot flush toilet, and of course, this towel rack. So dual entry restroom, you can enter from either the living area or the bedroom. We're going to go through here and into the bedroom. This is a wardrobe slide. It gives us some extra space to walk around the bed. It also gives us some additional storage. We have some hanging wardrobe in here. Here we have our queen bed. Each side has outlets and USB ports. Each side has an end table. We have storage all the way around the bed. We have yet another AC in here. TV hookup, of course, is directly across from the bed. Recline comfortably, be entertained, enjoy your vacation. That is what it is all about in the end. So, 2021 CRC class, great RV for you and your family, great RV for you and your friends. I hope you check this one out. We also have more fifth wheels online at zoomersrv.com. Thank you.